Hello, everyone. Ooh. Uh, and welcome to 8-Bit Adventures Game Night, where we are uh, playing through uh, more of my new game plus for Fire Emblem. Uh, playing more Golden Deer. And this is basically kind of right before the time skip. So if, uh, if you don't want major spoilers... Um, you might want to reconsider watching the stream, uh, because basically this next mission will, uh, I think it's this next mission goes into some deep, deep spoilers. So, um, but yeah, so, uh, this is picking up where I last left off playing. Um, and, uh, it turns out I was in the middle of an exploration. So, uh, we'll finish up with that and then get right into the mission. So. Uh, yeah. Um. So I don't remember what exactly I did today. <laughs> um. I'm gonna try and see if maybe I can do some flying? I can't. Okay. <laughs> hmm, okay, this will be interesting because uh, I'm trying to get Ingrid to join my class. She's like the last person that I need. Uh, and I'm really, really bringing it down to the wire here. Um, and I think I already asked her to join and she You've been Maybe refused. Maybe it is told I wonder. Yeah. So. Mm. Oh, this, this. I don't know. I guess I might not be able to recruit her. Oh, this is not good. This is very much not good. <laughs> oh, dear. Um, let's see. Did I already... I think I already had a meal with her and Sylvain. Let's just see. Ingrid. Yep. Oh, boy. Um, let's see if that's ended for the day. Okay, so I already did that. Oh, no. <laughs> There's not a whole lot left for me to do. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Well. Although, what chapter is this? What, what chapter am I on? I feel like maybe there's, maybe there's like one more. Because I haven't gotten Sedith either. And that's also concerning. Oh, I already... I need to talk to Manuela and train swords. Also, yeah, okay, so my mic is working. All right. Sometimes I forget to turn my mic on. Okay, no, I think I do have a little bit more, maybe? Okay, so I think I might still have one more. Uh, one more uh, chance. Is everybody... Oh! Oh! Oh dear, okay. Well, I might as well use it for dining hall. Um, I think Claude and Lysithia need motivation. Eating. And then, as always, uh, Ignatz and Marianne, because, ugh, God, I'm trying to pair people up at the end of the game, and it's just not working out. This food, I like. All right. All 
All right, come on. Um, hmm. Uh, the thing is, if I host Tea Party, I could get Charm. I think I will. Um, she likes sweet things, so we're gonna go Did with a honey me? fruit oh. blend. And then this is where I'm gonna cheat a little bit. I am grateful. This is a really weird part of the game. <laughs> you, I don't think I'd be who I am today. Well now. Ah. Oh, I didn't even get a bonus charm from that. Oh, there's a golden apple. Okay. That's charm. Oh, these gauntlets need to be repaired. Like, whoa. Um, that iron bow does. But I don't really do a lot of bow attacks with ignorance. This totally needs to be repaired. That's what makes Hilda an absolute beast. We're actually going to forge that. Oh, cool. Bullion. Um, yeah, and, and then Felix randomly wanted to join. Uh, was not planning on him. <laughs> I guess I'm just that cool. <laughs> that even, even Felix just randomly wanted to join my class. Oh, that poisons foes. Um, prepare, prepare. Um, yeah, I think we're going to upgrade this to a steel bow. Uh, and then maybe... Yeah, we'll do a silver bow. Do a long bow and get extra range. Except, uh... Oh, and then I can make the Brave Bow. I think I'm just going to make it a Silver Plus. Yeah, because uh, Dorothea... Not, sorry, not Dorothea. Bernadetta, uh, her main purpose in this playthrough of my game is for supporting Raphael. So, um, let's see. Um, nobody's level 30 yet, so I don't have to worry about master classes. None of those. Um, right, golden apple. Increases charm by one. Let's just give that to Dorothea. Just increase her charm by like a million. See what else we got. Got anything else? Oh, just lots of bullion.
There we go. Let's do the mission. Oh no, there's a paralogue that I'm going to be missing out on. Oh I am no. Grateful. I bet it's Felix's. Oh, that's so, that's terrible. Oh well. At least I have him unlocked now for You're a future place. You're going to playthrough. receive the goddess's revelation at the holy tomb? That's news to me. I did not see that coming. Lady Rhea's going too, right? I hear it will be well guarded, but is that So, really this okay? is a bit of a spoiler, but these are, are the Golden Deer uniforms so after the time skip. So, it turns appear. out when you uh of place this holy tomb is, but we when you cautious. complete the game, any students happens, that you had recruited after the time skip, uh, you get to use, what you're you able to professor? use their uh, really okay for Lady Rhea to sort of war costumes, is what they call them. It seems to be tightly sealed, I'll give you that. We should be fine as long as nothing goes terribly wrong. Yep, just as long as nothing goes wrong. Well, the truth is, we won't know what's going to happen until it happens. All we can do is stay on our guard and play it by ear. That's quite enough babbling, Claude. There is nobody more unfit for a holy ceremony than you. Um, divine punishment won't strike us for sitting foot in the holy tomb, right? Good grief. Why are you always so negative? Hmm? Flame? Is something on your mind? Who, me? No. It is nothing. May we all see this through to the end. It still doesn't make sense to me. A goddess was living inside Teach, right? But now there's a ceremony to receive a revelation or whatever. How could that be necessary anymore? There must be another objective. Ho, 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 ho. It's pointless to speculate about it now. We'll know the answer soon enough. There isn't any danger for us students, but be careful, Teach. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if this is the last mission before the time skip or not. Are you surprised, Professor? This is the Holy Tomb. That mechanism for descending underground back there. What power is it? When I tried to come by myself, it wouldn't even budge. This is where the goddess who created this world was laid to rest, along with her children. It is said that our creator... The goddess Sothis sat upon this very throne. Professor, do you recognize this throne? So long. I have waited so very long for this day. I bet Sit you upon have. The throne. I have no doubt you will be gifted a revelation from the goddess. Well, it was supposed to be but a step away. What could possibly be missing? Sorry to disturb you when you're distressed, Archbishop, but it seems some uninvited guests have arrived. <laughs> Don't move, any of you. If you move, your lives will be forfeit. Thank you ever so much for guiding us this far. The Imperial Army will now take possession of everything in the Holy Tomb. <laughs> the Imperial Army? What are they doing here? So, they knew we were heading to the Holy Tomb and followed us here. Hey, who is that standing next to the angry guy? Could that be... The Flame Emperor. I see. So you've been allied with the Empire from the beginning. What are they doing here? What do they hope to gain? There's only one goal for grave robbers like these. Right, Flame Emperor? You're here to steal the treasure that rests within the Holy Tomb. For a fool, you catch on quickly. Those crest stones will be ours. Nah. That infernal power, which is masquerading as a medicine but is truly a poison, will plague this world no longer. Insolence! You will atone for the sin of trampling on this holy resting place. Professor, 
Destroy these villainous traitors who dare dishonor our creator! Yep. Ah, I was hoping that I actually had more time to recruit Ingrid, but... Oh, uh, no. I needed flying, I guess. Okay. Who, who do we got? Oh, I can only have nine. I can only have nine. Okay. Um, in that case, uh, I think I would rather take Hilda over Lawrence. Ow, that's right, but I can't. All right. Since I can't do it the other way around. Oh, they all get Spermadetta. Uh, is there anyone else? I don't think so. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. um I'll take flight. All right. That's right. We got to send people all over the place. I've got some beasts, demonic beasts, flame emperor, stooge dude. Yeah, and then we basically just got to rush and prevent people from grabbing the stuff. Um, okay, so where's a slight sissy that's over here? So she's got range. Raphael's over there, too, so if I can get his movement up and just, like, send him careening everywhere. Uh, we've got all our ranged people over here. All right, so... Uh, I think I want to send Claude over this way. Marianne over this way. Also, danger zone! Wow, okay. All right, let's do this. I will not allow such violence from the Empire. Strike down the rebels and protect the Holy Tomb. Okay. The crest stones are in the cat. The Holy Tomb must not be... Earn rewards based on the I guess we're crest fighting stones. over who gets those crest stones. What in the world do they intend to use them for anyway? Oh, at most nefarious purposes. All right. So... Basically, we just, we gotta, ooh. There we go. Nice. Ooh, that was a, that was a good level up. I got this. That's my cue. Dance, dance, dance. Hey, hey. Hey, Damn it. I got an idea. There we go. Now those peeps can't move. Um let's see. Oh, I do not want Lawrence stuck in danger zone. I stand ready. So, what we'll do is... Stride. Thank you. Ready anytime. Um, I think we want to send... Let's get to it. Um, oh. Maybe not. Okay. Ooh, yeah, we send her down here. I call that a win. I'm aiming. Things done. Leave it 
to me. Deleted. You were outmatched. Oh, that's why. Okay. That's Stay focused. that's fine. Ooh, actually, can I get Oh, I can, because I have stride as well. Um, yeah. That is that. Another... So one of the downsides of this game, um, and I don't know, this is my first Fire Emblem game, aside from Fire Emblem Heroes, which I'm not sure really counts. But uh, it just, it kind of feels like Pokemon in the regard that um, there's not a lot of strategy within a combat so much as like you're just kind of lining up your units to try and one shot as many people as possible. Um, Ready and willing. I'm just going to do this. Pull out all the stops. It's not luck, it's fate. Yeah, yeah, they're not going to get far. Oh, those guys might get pretty far. You underestimated me. Strength in action. That, that dude all the way down there. Oof. Oof. Um, that's going to be tough. Sorry. Don't know my own strength. It's over. As expected. It's going to be tough getting down there. Uh, I'm going to try, though. Oh, can I actually reach? Anything else? Oh, probably not. That's that's quite a ways. Oh! Well... able to get that far. Not today. I did it. I did. Oof. Big danger. Big danger indeed. Alright. It's the range on this thing. Oh, ho, 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 whoa. Uh, that's not good. Thankfully, I think I still have range. Yes. I just worked harder. Um. Bu 
pa 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 Winning's always nice. All right, so we got that. I think if I take out Okay, that's fine. These armored dudes. Pretty sure. Oh. Well then. Yeah, that's that's not gonna that's not gonna go over well. Uh, so we're just gonna move over here. Draw my hand back. Just continue to silence that guy for experience points. We'll kind of just lead those guys on a wild goose chase. Oh, they're getting greedy. I didn't realize that they would do that. I figured that they would just swipe one and then, and then head out. I didn't realize that they would continue going after them. That's that's dumb. Good. That's not that's not a good move on their part. Uh yeah. Especially since Womp. gone. You were outmatched. That was good. That was good. Um, yeah, we'll go this way. I'll aid you. Now's our chance. And uh, my favorite gambit is just we're just gonna load a bunch of explosive stuff on a cart and then launch it. There. Um. Okay, Ignatz. Yeah, we need you to. We need you to move in. Um, I want Leone to take this guy out. Another one down. Why well, everybody's safe? That's good. Everybody's safe from that. Anybody have stuff they can use? Raphael does. So we may have just have to dance his way up there. I think. I want to be all I Oh, yeah, then I can move... Yeah. This will work. Lawrence up. I'm still... There we go. Dark Beast's armor's broken. And then stunned for a turn. Um... There we go. No magic for you. Oh, Claude's got to do something. He's got to do something. Let's move him here. Yeah. Like the present. 
Well, that wasn't quite what I had planned, but we'll, we'll see how it plays out. Well, that could have been worse. Yeah, uh, Raphael's just gonna do what he does best and just... Falcon Punch. <laughs> I can Not bad for Bernie. That was amazing. There we go. Um... Ooh, I could warp. You can't compete with me. That might be the play. Uh, oh, you know what? No, this is totally the play. At least for Raphael. And then... Punch! Punch! <laughs> One man wrecking crew. Um. Let us know. Yeah. Don't underestimate us. Yeah, we got to get this armor off. That's what we want to see. And then, we'll have Claudio here. Actually, no. Let Claude go here. Oh, really? yet. Oh, that was pretty good. Alright, who needs to go? Oh, Lysithia and moi. I'm Marianne. Okay. Uh, yeah. Totally gonna warp myself. Yeah. I think we might go to the left. But I do want to help these guys out, take this monster out, and then we can all regroup. Oh, actually. Can Marianne get the monster? Nope. But she can silence that one. about that one. <laughs> but it turned out okay. I actually won. All right. Let's get everybody regrouped. I have high movement. Pick that up.
Get everybody topped off. Zoom, zoom, zoom! Um, yeah. Swap. Reposition. Then we'll just, we'll put Raphael out there as bait. <laughs> um, and then we'll just uh, put Dorothea there for passive healing. Oh, wait. <laughs> That's it. Bring everybody out here. Actually, what we're going to do is warp. Up to the front line. Put Leone over there. Uh, we're just gonna move Raphael right up, right up front. Um, and we'll have him take out the archer. Sorry, don't know my own strength. So that way. You're outclassed. Oh no, Marianne, you gotta catch up. Oh. Yes, I am totally ready and willing. Gonna go back in time. There we go. To That's shove you. a different person. Have yeah, I'm convinced that uh, Dorothea will be able to tank magical attacks. <laughs> Apparently, Raphael can tank magical attacks too. Also, I'm realizing that eventually we're going to have to send a contingency over to the other side, so... Um, you Ready know what? We're going to have... Uh, B-team go that way. Let's get to it. Um, we'll send Leone over that way as well. This, this is a pretty, pretty tanky side up here. I got this. Should have trained better. Stay focused. But no, no, we're gonna actually no. We'll have Raphael just do this and move up further. I stand ready. Wow. That's it. Oh. Uh, I couldn't do anything. A trivial victory. That was pretty good.
What's in that side? Oh. Magic man. Um. Let's see. What's the uh, what's the old range on flame of Yeah. We don't want to do that. Don't want to send Raphael running in just yet. So. I could have had him use up his pure water. Let's do that. Let's do that. I got this. There we go. That's my cue. So pure water uh, boosts <laughs> Raphael's resistance by seven, and since Ready that and is his weak stat, it just means Leave he's to me. totally unstoppable. One hundred percent, no weakness. Ready anytime. Let's get to it. And clear out the other side first. And then we'll move everybody in. Oh. Well then. Okay. Alright, that means, uh, not in danger. Punch, punch. One that. Raphael is known as Two Punch Man. I stand ready. Stay focused. Hmm, I, I definitely don't. I'm kind of scared of the fact that, uh... They've got these folks all marching down this way, though. It's a little concerning. But we'll see how it goes. Whoop! Well, here they come. I think we'll just have to, uh, again, put Raphael up there as bait. Okay. Okay. All right. So we'll have to move Lysithia so that she doesn't get attacked by uh, Edgy Boy. Um, all right. We should be okay. We're not in range of the Flame Emperor. Okay. So Ignatz and Leone are in range. This guy... Yeah. How do you like that? Okay. So... I think we might be able to... Nope. Darn. I was going to say we could probably... Oh, wait. We could we could get in here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm told it's fine to kill those who resist. Now then, how shall I cook you? Uh you won't. Oh.
Ready and willing. How? First off, how dare you? We'll do this. So you're not going anywhere. Who? Yep, draw back. Nice, nice, nice. Stay focused. Um, That's my cue. I stand ready. Eat it. Oh, boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Alright, um, I think... Oh. Yeah, we'll just use my old Sublime Creator Sword. It's over. Each battle, a chance to grow. You're incredible! Um... Yeah, Raphael really needs to get his, uh love skill up for his brawling skill up so we'll just get in as many punches as we can um, yeah done okay this will be interesting Yeah, what can get me the most experience points? Uh, and I, I think, I think it's this. So hay slice. Oh. Well, there we go. <laughs> I'm getting better. An interesting one. All defensive. <gasps> so. The end has come. Is this some sick joke? The Flame Emperor is actually Edelgard? Bum, bum, bum. You have disappointed me, Edelgard, to think that a descendant of House Heresvelg would dare betray the Holy Church. Professor, kill Edelgard at once. She is a danger to all of Fodlin. Such a rebellious heart cannot be allowed to keep beating. I have achieved my objective. I will retreat. Farewell, Professor. Come, Hubert. To flee is futile, wicked girl. The Church of Seros will raise its entire army against you until you have been captured and punished. You have defiled the holy tomb, dishonored the goddess, and humiliated your brethren. That crime will never be erased. Even if you burn in the eternal flames and spill all of your blood into the goddess's soil. Come, Professor. Let us return and decide upon our next course of action. 
I'm not exactly on friendly terms with the princess, but I do have a few questions for her. Edelgard said that the crest stones represent power. That means she knows how to use them. She almost certainly knows other secrets of Fodlin as well. Once things calm down a bit, there's a lot more that Rhea needs to tell us. I just hope there's still time. I have this strange feeling that history is being written. That an age of anarchy is upon us. Let's hope I'm mistaken. Oh, Claude. Oh, buddy. The leaders of the church have misused its creed to fulfill their true desire. To rule the world. They have fooled the people of Fodlin. Long ago, they divided the empire to create a kingdom. And then, divided that kingdom to create an alliance. They did all of this to make the masses bicker amongst themselves. They caused instability in order to reinforce their own authority. They gathered gold and lived in extravagance. How? By preying on the devotion of those who wished for the goddess's salvation. Those corrupt hypocrites cannot lead Fodlin to true peace. Their foul belief system must be torn asunder. So that yeah, uh, the problem prevail. is, and so I have to when you're an empress that lives in extravagance, you can't really call out somebody else for living in supposed extravagance. Nearby declares war on the Church of Seraphs. I cannot believe it. Let us recount the situation as it stands. Professor, the Adrestian Empire declared war upon the Church of Seraphs as well as our allies. Edelgard demanded her own father relinquish the throne, and then assumed the position of emperor. She has deemed the Church of Seros to be an evil of this world, and is calling upon the people of Fodlin to help her tear it down. I must discuss our response to this declaration with the Archbishop, after the Knights return from their investigation. Until then, watch over the students. See that they remain calm. I heard what happened, Teach. The princess, well... The Emperor now. She really did it, didn't she? The Lords and Dukes of both the Kingdom and the Alliance have been called out, and now have to choose between the Church and the Empire. The seed of conflict was always there, and now we find ourselves in the middle of a war that will tear Fodlin in two. The Empire is rash, but I never thought it would come to this. How could something like this happen? I hope everyone back home is safe. I'm sure it's mass confusion at home right now. My brother must be worried sick about me. You're absolutely right, Teach. I'm sure a lot of us are worried about our homes, but all we can do for now is prepare for battle and tread carefully. Part One, White Clouds, Lone Moon, To War. To War! To get... We're gonna, we're gonna skip this. So yeah, uh, the little dude moves left and right. <gasps> there is still time. Okay. There's still time, folks. Unforgivable. <clears throat> I cannot fathom that the Adrestian Empire would embark on such a violent course of action. The fault is my own. I failed to see the wickedness within Edelgard's heart. There is no question on that front. She clearly wishes to conquer all of Fodlin. And in order to achieve her own selfish ambitions, she plotted with ill-meaning strangers and defiled the Holy Tomb. Or perhaps her ambitions are even grander than we know. Perhaps she is planning to make herself a false deity by demonizing the Church of Seros. Adrestia received its very name through a divine oracle. To injure the goddess is a sin most foul that shall not be forgiven nor forgotten. We must stop the Empire, and quickly. 
I have returned, Rhea. Welcome back, Shamir. Were you able to discern the Empire's movements? Their main troops are marching towards Garrick Mach. It is said that they will join forces with Edelgard's army and arrive within two weeks. Two weeks? That is not enough time. It will require all of our efforts just to prepare our defenses before then. We must send notice to all surrounding villages at once. We must order the residents of Garrick Mach to flee for their lives. It will be done. Professor, listen closely. If our enemy invades the monastery, I will have no choice but to stand upon the battlefield. If something happens to me, I am entrusting my sacred duties to you. You must have guessed it by now. The truth of who you are, or perhaps I should say, your lost memories are surely beginning to return. I have acted all these long years as a mere proxy for you. But the duty is yours, and yours alone. Only you can lead the people of Foblen. This is where, folks, we learn that this is actually, like, a Xeno game. <laughs> Rhea, please. You must tell me all that you know. I beg of you. <sighs> that one is the progenitor god. Am I correct? In a sense. Our dear professor is a vessel. One who carries the power of the progenitor god within. In time, the vessel will become one with the power contained within, and the progenitor god shall return to this world. I see. I trust that you are aware of the questionable nature of this experiment. But I suppose there is no turning back. I ask that you help our friend. And in doing so, help her. I am waiting and hoping for the moment when our creator rules this wayward land once more. I understand. As ever, I will take you at your word. Lady Rhea! Brother, I will do my part as well. Flame! Are you eavesdropping? <sighs> Regardless, I am glad to hear it. You owe your life to the Professor, after all. And in the end, they may prove to be our brethren. You have my gratitude, Sedith. And you as well, Flame. As followers of the Progenitor God, it is up to us to see our mission through. Support. Oh, Lawrence and Lysithia. Picking what? Yeah. Anyone else? No. No. All right. Uh, we're gonna explore. The doors—they just opened on their own. Flying! No, I can't buy flying! <laughs> no! Eagle Eye, seeking intel on the Imperial Army. Is this a combat mission? We must protect Garrick Ma, defiling the Holy... The Archbishop has already given you a new responsibility. I want you to rise to that honor. I have something to ask of you. A Knight of Saros would have that kind of information. Okay. Um... Ooh. All right, we must put defy the archbishop. No recruit, no recruits. Oh, um, who else can teach me flying? I want to. Is it Raya? Excuse me. How are with the thankfully? You have the divine protection of the... May the god... No. Uh, but I also need to do as much as I can to train in swords. Maybe it's Manuela. Maybe Manuela can teach me flying. Uh, 
to fail. Well, we're depending on your strength, Professor. Crush it, Captain! sense though does it they would need to... Ugh, I'm gonna mostly I'm worried about my old opera company I wonder what's happening in the capital right now I hope they're safe <laughs> the glory okay so we got that far <laughs> maybe just maybe Ingrid will now join and, uh, yeah, because this is it. This is it, folks. <laughs> after, uh, after this, there's, uh, not really any turning back. I mean, I suppose I could, I could do another exploration, but that would be a waste. Um, I feel like, uh, lost items. Nope. Oh no, I lost all my lost items. I think. Oh, you're, you're all good to go anyways. Okay, who needs uh, Lawrence and Hilda, Leone, Bernadetta, Dorothea, Petra and Felix, Sedeth. Oh, Sedeth auto-joined. Perfect. I don't need to worry about Sedeth then. That's, that's fantastic. Um, okay. Oh, Dimitri's there. Uh, oh, Gilbert. I don't know if I can grab Gilbert, though. What? Error always. I didn't actually... I feel as though I'm not a professor. If I survive this war... No, that doesn't... Gifts. Um... Nope. I gotta go buy have to go buy things. All right. First, where is Ingrid? Oh, perfect. Harvest. Ah, uh, no, no stat boosts. All right, we'll buy some red flower seeds. Edelgard mean for us, Professor? And why does she even want that? I wonder why she... That's how it always goes, I guess. You never... Oh, there's red flower seeds. Wait, does Bernie need... Okay, she does. Um... That's okay. Hard. Nope, nope, watering can. She's like the only person that likes watering cans, so give that to her. What's funny is like how um, basically New Game Plus, like I don't need to do fishing at all. And it's really like you have a good eye, a pleasure. not you until have uh you have a good you have a good you have a good there's like fistfuls of fish or it's like special golden fish that I really care and I'll basically just like stockpile bait until a pleasure doing business you have flower seeds we're gonna get pleasure come again so that's like you know, three weekends worth of uh, this one, yes. I think this one, yes. I think this one, yes. I think this of one, gardening. Yes. I think this one, 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 yes. I think return soon, please. Yep, I will. Professor. You know, Professor, I'm glad that I came to the Officers Academy. I feel accepted here. I've learned so much. Honestly, I'm surprised at how much I've grown. So. I will not let the Academy be destroyed. It's important to me, and I will protect it. I 
feel braver. We're gonna win this, Professor. Well, pardon me. Greetings, Professor. Something to report. Unexpected, isn't it? Apparently, this is the first time Garrick Mach has been invaded in its whole 995-year history. It's my job to protect this gate. So even if enemies come in droves, I will never let them through. I hope we both survive. Let's battle with all our might and pray Gatekeeper we win this thing. is the best character. He must be protected at all costs. I cannot believe our negligent Edelgard probably gathered her soldiers in Garrig Mach. Soldiers disguised as merchants and pilgrims to avoid suspicion. They couldn't be better prepared. We'll have a tough time winning this one, I'm afraid. Uh, no. No, I didn't. Gatekeeper is the best character. <laughs> Regardless of which playthrough you go through. Although I suppose that if you end up doing uh, the bad row, uh, you don't get Gatekeeper anymore. Well done. You have my thanks. Okay. So, what was I doing? I need... Okay. So, first off, let's do choir practice because... Uh, and the notes. Because I think it's special choir Hello practice day. There. Right? Yes. Choir festival. Always despise the heat. Even as a child, still one must be prepared no matter the conditions. Any advice for enduring the heat? There you go, Dimitri. I know I can't recruit you, but I'm still going to be your friend. For now. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Uh, we need as much as possible. Regardless, it's hard to. I have zero intentions of. Can we really defeat someone who is willing to turn their back on the world? Just to uphold their own beliefs? I've spent my whole life running in fear. And now, I... Surely we can win if we win. Yes. Right. <sighs> Professor. War is breaking out if there was a truly... I never want... All we can do is steal ourselves. Let's see, do I have enough needs for statue? Nope. You again soon. Need another thousand points. Right. I'll get that after uh, after the oh, time skip. Okay. So first things first is we gotta go. Um, we want luck plus two. Cooking? Because Raphael, You're not going his to special personal ability right? is based on luck. Our dish. Yes, so I will good. always pick luck plus two. <laughs> just, just that it gives him an extra 2% chance to regain health at the start of his turn. Today's special, okay. So we want Sylvain and Ingrid. It's weirdly soothing watching you just shovel it right in there. What's with the appetite today? None of your business. I can't help it, okay? Everyone gets hungry after exercise. Okay, and then... What is it that... There's something... Oh, it's the two fish saute. There we go. Nothing... There is no need... 
Oh, wow. I really, really ran out of stuff quick. Um, okay. Uh, we want... We want... What are we, where is it? Oh, no. I lack Albinian herring. I guess I'm going to have to go fishing. Well, let's see if we can, uh, let's see, does Aloise like this? He does, okay. Oh, my. That looks delicious. Yeah, I really don't know. Aloise. Oh, okay. We got two left. Let's do some fishing. That's everybody's goals. Oh no, Dorothea! Where's Dorothea? This is this is of uh, the utmost importance. Dear me, Edelgard became emperor and raised an army, huh? Who knew the kid had it in her? I mean, yeah, of course, I knew she'd be emperor eventually, but the more I think about it, the more surprised I am. I wonder who's gonna win. Thinking about it makes me scared. We're up against the entire Imperial Army. Still, I know someone as smart as you will figure something out. You see, Dorothea, when you're confronted with... Uh, an insurmountable force of the Imperial Army. You just have to look for a small thermal exhaust port about two meters wide. And then you just have to shoot, like, giant, massive thermonuclear warheads down it. Uh, and then you just destroy the entire Imperial Army. Easy peasy. Are you sure? Thank you, I love it. And then... Are you Here, clip. Okay. Alright. Now that we did that, we can go fishing. I don't know what quality the, the herring is, so we're going to save our high quality bait. I think the herring might be, like, large fish. And really, all we need is the one herring. <laughs> because there, there will always be, uh... more opportunities for fishing after the time skip. Actually, you know what? Let's just look this up real quick, so that way, uh... That way... We are making the best use of our time. Ooh! This will not get me an Albinian herring, but that's okay. Because it'll get me, uh, like a bullhead or something cool. Maybe it's a little fish.
<laughs> Consumables. Fishing. I have fishing in there yet. Um, or dining hall. Hmm. Okay, it looks like it's a small fish. We want small fish. I suppose we could do just like one of the, you know, the bad meals that nobody really likes, but where's the fun of that? There we go. Nyah. Zoom. Grilled herring. For the Dragon Twins. Ah, uh, meals always. Do you not enjoy eating? Okay. Um, is there any other stuff that I can do? Oh, I can give more gifts to Gilbert. What? There are oh, Ingrid. I did. I feel professor. Gifts. Fishing float. What else does he enjoy? He likes... Oh, what does he like? Oh, Ceremonial Sword. One... And... Got a statue, maybe? Maybe? I think it's a goddess statue. Maybe Legends of Chivalry? Nope, got a statue. This is one. Now you should you should come join my my thing. I don't know if he actually can. Uh Yeah, he's not in the list, so I'm going to assume that I can. Uh, and that's that's sad. Oh, Ingrid. To think that the flame flames abduction, whether or not she was the mastermind, and yet she was able to remain so composed while she was enrolled at the officers' academy. Okay. Gifts. Smoke meat. For me? Writing for me? Thank you. Legends of Shimmy. Thank you. What more do I need to give you? She just joined my class already. Oh, 
Thank you very much. Like, thank you. All the daffodils. Thank you. Thank you very. Thank you very much. You know, I got a ton of coffee beans. Does she dislike coffee beans? Nope. Guess who's getting coffee Thank beans? You Thank you very. Thank you very. Thank you. Thank you very. And then, invite to tea. Oh, there we go. Tea time. Thank you for inviting me. <laughs> what a nice aroma. I really enjoy this tea. Thank you. Just checking my time. How relaxing. Yes. Boop, boop, boop. Wow. Ooh, equipment upkeep. Yes. Monastery security. These are all very, very interesting topics, I'm sure. Yes. There we go. When did you start sword training? I was five when I began. That's that's very early. <laughs> Thank you for the treat. Okay. Here's the thing. So we're gonna save. To think, flames, weather, and yet you. Good timing, Prof. Will you put me in your? There are so many things yes! I can learn from you. Thank you, but I will There we go. <laughs> I was so worried it wasn't gonna happen. <sighs> right down to the wire. Uh, let's see. Who's who's left? There's like So Gilbert. Um to do Casper. Dimitri and Rhea are the only people left. You know, not counting, you know, the, the riffraff that Edelgard took with her. Which, um... Now that I think about it... Uh... Because I heist... I, I pretty much stole Bernie, Dorothea, Petra, Linhart, Ferdinand. <laughs> so she might just have Hubert. I think. It might just be her and Huber against the world. Uh, and in that case, I mean, hmm, maybe, maybe you should rethink your strategy, Edelgard. Maybe. Ah, uh, Okay. Whew. There we go. Um, she's a Pegasus Knight? What do you need for Falcon Knight? Sword, Lance, and Flying. So, we're gonna want to change this up to Lance and Flying. Make him a wyvern lord. He's gonna need axe and flying. What is this? What is this? No, axe, flying. <laughs> um, I don't know what what Hanneman is gonna do. Uh, Alois, um, Alois is a strong candidate for a war master, so he's got that going for him. Yep, that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good, yeah. Oh, this is good, yeah. Um. Yes, that's good. Yes! Okay. Uh, so again, 
since that was successful, we want to save. And we can end today's free time. Um, yeah. So, I always want to train Raphael, because he always needs training and stuff. Um... I definitely want to make sure that he gets, uh, the requisite stuff for, um, becoming a War Master, because I'm going to have him go into War Master, master that, uh, then probably go into Great Knight, um, because I think he's got, he's had pretty good stat bumps, um, because of those. So, because I went this time, instead of just going straight into, like, super tank um, the whole way, is I did... Actually, I can just show you. Um, so, as you can see from the top, uh, we went... Um, what was that? Fighter into Brigand. Um, and then I did a little bit of Brawler for the stat bumps once I got... Uh, the mastery ability for Brigand. Then from Brawler, went into Fortress Knight. Um, so, like, between Brigand and Brawler, he gets good attack and then speed level ups, which, like, speed's a weakness of his, so really increasing it helped out. Uh, then Fortress Knight just makes him super tanky. And then going back into War Master kind of goes back onto the uh, uh, attack and speed benefit. And then Great Knight, after getting those stat bumps, um, just gives him, like, extra movement, which will be good. Um, so, yeah. Uh, so, for Bernie, the advantage that we have for Bernie is that we can just... Because I think she already has uh, lances, although... For Bow Knight, she also... Okay, so she does need lance. Um... I think we want to focus on getting her horse ability up to A, and then we'll just get, you know, lances up to C. Um, Dorothea. Um, yeah, I do want to give her sword ability. Because it turns out, Dancer is just really a really good sword class. Um, so that's good. Uh, I got two more left. So basically two pairs of people left. Um, yeah, I think we want to do Ignatz and Marianne. Uh, Ignatz, we would just want to go full ham on swords. Just to try and see if I can get him up to S+. Plus. I've really... I don't know if I'm going to be able to, but we'll try. Um, and then Marianne. Um, we're trying to do Holy Knight for her, so we want to get her riding up to A rank. Um, and then... Yeah, let's, let's do Lawrence and Hilda. And again, same, th kind of the same thing with Lawrence. Get his riding up for Dark Knight. <laughs> that was Adam. And then for Hilda, we want to get flying up to A for Wyvern Ward. And that's it. Uh, for group tasks, I just, I, throughout the whole game so far, I've had Raphael paired with Bernie for riding. I would like to ask you something. Give me the cold show, Desolate. It is because, I believe it is because they're intimidated by my noble presence. How can I be more accessible? Uh, talk oh, more sorry. about their interests. Professor.
bow and riding skills. No, we're still working on axe and flying skills. Cyril. Come on. Whose birthday? It's Shamir's birthday. Thank you. you just give her flowers. Just leave this. I'm glad it's you. Look, Professor, we did great. Nice. Ah, oh, we're so close with Claude. Oh my God, we're so close with so many people. At least Dorothea got up to. There we go. Oh my god. <laughs> All of these skill ups that are just on the verge of leveling up is, is bothering me so much. It's all coming together. I'm finding my focus. Oh, that's right. I have healing focus on Raphael. But he never gets hurt, so he never needs to be healed. Um yeah, I think we're going to battle. But first... Holy Knights of Saros. Index Sword Fighters. Alliance Physicians... Alliance Sages, Alliance Guard. I mean, I do like the Alliance Guard. But I'm just... Eh. Like, I kind of have a lot of the best ones right now. Let's just see. Uh, does Ingrid come with a bullion? She does. Occasionally increasing the might of magic attacks. Um, I should figure out who to give that to. Um, I suppose Mercedes. Oh, you know what? There you go, Flame. Have an extra crest. Uh, yeah, I don't know if anybody really... Oh, no, somebody somebody got an ability. Hilda got an ability. Seal speed. Oh, and seal defense. Death blow. Oh, those are all really good. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna battle. Get some good stuff. Ooh, rare meats. So, I'm gonna do this one battle, and then uh, I think that might be it for the stream. Maybe. Um, we'll see how close to 10 o'clock we go. Oh, also, I'm dropping frames like crazy. What is going on? I think I'll have to uh, I'll have to check my uh, my router. Might have to power cycle my router. I th I think I'm due for a, a firmware upgrade too, so that might be part of it. Might be. Okay, so I'm gonna have ten people. Um. Oh, Flane, what are you doing here? No, we gotta get we gotta get Hilda. We're all, we're all set here. Um, yeah, we're totally all set. Wait. No. What's Lawrence doing with that spear? There. Maybe else equipped with weird weapons. 
No? Okay, good. Time to fight. Oh, this map. This map's great, said nobody. Oh, this is one where Hilda's just gonna go wreck everybody. Because she can fly. Okay. Um, first things first. I stand ready. Is Stride, because apparently Stride <laughs> remains like the best thing in the game. I got this. Yeah, we're just gonna send Raphael up to the front. That's my cue. Stay focused. Send Dorothea in behind to dance. And then send Raphael up even further. Strength in action. There we go. Zoom. Ready anytime. Oh, that's right. There's like a weird road that runs behind Ready here. And willing. Um, well, spellcasters don't have to deal with that. Oh, Claude has stride. That's why. He's so fast. Um, we're going to move him up here. Bravo! Sorry, the victory is mine. Leave it to me. Play Scythia up next to Quad. Oh, she can't attack yet. Interesting. Very interesting. Oh, we're gonna move Marianne all the way behind her. Her boo. Who? Me? Big knots. No, not you, Hilda. Let's get to it. There we go. No! No, we cannot build support among other people. Can't do it. Um. Yeah, we're gonna move Leone. Oh, why did I not give her a brave bow? Ugh. She deserves a brave bow. Uh, and yeah, Hilda's just, yeah, totally gonna go somewhere, somewhere where there's not bows, which is everywhere. I took out the one bow guy. I could send her back here and draw. Now nah, I want to draw all those people out to the front. Yeah, so we'll fly her over here. This way she'll, uh, yeah, she'll get a rank ride pretty soon. He's dealing damage to Raphael? What? He must have a hammer. Oh no. That monster. It took out a bandit. Nope. Marianne, you are not healing Raphael. You're not doing it. Big Knots should be able to... Uh, the, the dodge. That's what I'm looking for. Dodge. Thanks for that. Any attacks that come his way. 
Um, yeah, let's have to that. Gambit. There we go. King of Wings, the Wing King. This way. And then run away! Darn. That takes oh, we can care take of that. this guy. Um, let's see. I think Raphael wants to just go straight in. Man, are these guys all equipped with, with hammers? There we go. Should have trained better. We already moved those folks up there. Um, oh, I guess Dancer doesn't count as a caster. Well, that's rough. I don't really know where to where to move my forces right now. Uh, oh, Dorothea has has physics, so she can she can heal. Oh, progress suits me. That could have been uh, that could have been pretty bad for Claude. I'm so sorry. Bam, bam. I did it. I did. Or as I say in Critical Role, pop, pop. That's totally fine. We got this. That's right. We want you to heal Claude. It's not luck, it's fate. Build your support with him. Um <laughs> Raphael can't really move anywhere where he's useful. Oh, are you kidding me? Those guys moved away? Gonna do that. Um, twenty-seven, twenty-seven. You know what? I need sword skills. Nah, we're gonna use our silver sword. As expected. Yeah, these guys, man, they're, uh, they're actually, uh, putting in some work. I am actually I've got another option. kind of impressed of the fact that I need to heal and, uh, think about, uh, 
my people. Sort of. And then, of course, Hilda just comes in and ruins, like, everything. Okay, so at least it's there's still, uh... We're gonna do this. Oh, that's it? Oh. Okay, I'll get there. Um, he cannot. Marianne could. This should work. Let's do a gambit. Gonna reduce his stats. Oh, that's right, and I have Poison Strike on Ignatz. So... Okay. Now it's just uh b -b 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 bar bar bar. Agony is arrow. Ooh. Oh, you know what? It's probably uh I wonder what would happen. That would do this thing. Uh I wouldn't do much better. <laughs> okay, I think we'll just... Uh... Yeah, we'll just do it. That's fine. Because Hilda's just gonna... Hilda's gonna do it. Yep. Hilda MVP. All right. So I think that's going to be where uh, where I end the stream. Um, thank you for joining me, folks. Uh, sorry, we did not actually get to the time skip uh, and the, the major, major spoilers, but there were some pretty big spoilers revealed in this stream. Um, so, yeah. Um... But, uh, yeah, I totally forgot that there was, like, another chapter left. So, uh, it worked out. You know, I got to recruit Ingrid. So, uh, we got that. Um, if you would like to see more content from 8-Bit Adventures, be sure to check out 8-BitAdventures.com. Um, and if you want to help support all that content, from comics to podcasts to streams to all sorts of cool artwork and everything... Um, be sure to, uh, number one, follow this channel. Um, number two, you could uh, uh, become a subscriber. Um, don't forget that uh, if you have Amazon Prime, you also get one free Twitch Prime subscription each month. Uh, so please consider using it on this channel. Uh, and you can get cool emotes like so. Doot, doot, doot. Uh, and the more subscribers I have, the more emotes can be unlocked for all subscribers. So, uh, that is super cool. Um, alternatively, you could become a patron at patreon.com slash 8bitadventures. Over there you can get cool, uh, exclusive comics content, uh, and early access to a lot of stuff. Um, and you can become a patron for as little as a dollar a month. Um, as far as upcoming streams and stuff, uh, there is no stream tomorrow, uh, so the next stream will be on Wednesday, uh, for the 8-Bit Adventures podcast, so, um, but, uh, there will be a Berkshire Bites episode, that's a food podcast that my fiance and I do together, um, that will go up, uh, early next week, so, um, I think we're going to do oh desperados, so that should be that should be fun. Uh, I'll get chimichangas. So uh, yeah, that's gonna wrap it up, folks. So uh, thank you for joining me, and as always, have fun, happy gaming, and enjoy your pie cake. Good night, folks.